Right now at 5.30, rebranding a former Uptown entertainment hub. Over the years, we have seen the epicenter slowly fade into a neglected ghost town. And while now the Queen City Quarter looks the same, behind the scenes, property management very busy building an incoming tenant list. Queen City News Chief Business Correspondent Taylor Young joins us live from Uptown. So, Taylor, it's been nearly seven months since the rebranding was announced. What's the latest? Yeah, Morgan, when the new management team took over this property, this property was only 30 percent occupied. Fast forward today, they've signed on multiple new tenants and have locked in several ones that were already here. It's a little disappointing just because like I know how it used to look. From the naked eye, the former Uptown Epicenter looks untouched. Branding from 2008 and dust left behind from once bustling businesses. It's like a little ghost town. It's very chill, yeah. not as popular as it used to be. It's no surprise those that frequent the 300,000 square foot property were unaware of its rebrand. Nope, they not know I that. Did not know that. <laughs> the now Queen City Quarter is in its transitional phase. After its previous owner foreclosed on the property last year, a new management team took over. We are really excited about the progress we've made so far. The property's real estate broker says the goal is to create a safe, family-friendly environment. That means finding the right tenants to occupy the space. So far, they've signed four new businesses, including a coffee shop, photo op museum, and restaurant. As for filling the Queen City Quarter, Caitlin Fitch says it will take some time. In terms of a timeline, it's, it's really hard to say. These things take time. and. We've been pretty particular about the tenant mix, and with that, it, it does take time. So there's really no timeline, set timeline, but we are really excited about the progress we've made, and we're excited for what's to come. On top of incoming tenants, property management is improving infrastructure and security measures, a 24-7 security team, updated cameras, and new lighting. You know, walking through and just seeing a lot of happy faces and families and people having fun, this is what we're aiming for. Now, some of those infrastructure changes include repainting, improvements to the courtyard, and new staircases. Now, that construction is expected to begin by late spring. Now, reporting live in Uptown, Taylor Young, Queen City News. Yeah, a lot of residents excited to see those renderings come to life. Taylor, thanks.